but you're a boxer, right? In, I believe it was 1867, Queensbury rules came into play, right? Where we decided, hey, we better put some gloves on these hands. It'll protect the other person's face from cuts. Now you're going bare knuckle. Why not fight with a little more protection? Why bare knuckle fist fights? That's a good question. Um, so, you know, I, uh, I got the idea to start competing in bare knuckle FC. Actually, I was watching YouTube. And uh, I started watching these YouTube fights and I just kind of went down a rabbit hole with it. I probably watched five or six of these bare knuckle FC fights. And I'm sitting there and I'm thinking to myself, I can beat a lot of these guys, right? And then I think the very next day I happen to see on my phone that the organization is having open tryouts in Plant City, Florida, which is about 30 miles outside of Tampa. And uh, I just, I took it as a sign and I, I bought a plane ticket right there and then. I was coming off the couch, so I was fat and out of shape and overweight. I had two weeks to train for it. So I, I trained for two weeks, I got on the plane, I went out to uh, Tampa, Florida. A hundred people signed up for the tryouts, 50 people showed up and they gave out five contracts. I won one of them. And so now here we are. So you were surfing YouTube, where all bad ideas come from. We're surfing YouTube. I've been there, brother, uh, messing around, of course. But what is the attraction for you? Why, when you watched YouTube, did you go, I got to do that? Well, you know, like I said, you know, initially because I knew I had the ability to beat a lot of these fighters. Mm. And then also because of the opportunity that comes along with it. You know, we're still on the tail end of this pandemic, and through it all, I've been training and fighting and competing in Tijuana, right? You know, I, I fought in a parking lot of a baseball stadium in Tijuana. I fought in the Big Punch Arena, which probably holds about 50 people. And now I'm fighting here in Kansas in a arena on pay-per-view that's gonna be seen worldwide. So the opportunity to really go far and wide in the sport is what attracted me to it.